Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I am Josh Stripe Hayes. This is Dead Space One. You are the attractive and intelligence audience member who is joining us on this playthrough. So where were we going? We were going that way. We were shooting things in the garden. That's what we were doing. It's not as late as it was yesterday. It was quite scary playing this game late at night. But playing it like this is it's exciting. There's a thing on the floor. Camlab report. Elizabeth, no doubt you are aware of the organic growth found in some parts of the ship. I've been examining the substance and thought the results would interest you. The cells most closely resemble bacteria with viral behaviour. Like bacteria, the organism infects other cells through osmosis, then mutates and reproduces a long word. Hang on, I'm going to pronounce that. Aga, agamogonetically. Obviously, we all know what agamogonetically means. What's amazing is the speed at which it grows. A single bacterium reproduces 20-fold in just one minute. I've never seen anything like it. I won't state my reputation on it, but I think this may be a genuine alien life form. Professor Hawley theorises that it's a habitat transformer. The levels of gaseous output are tremendous, which is why it smells so bad. But to what end, we simply don't know. Okay, cool. So they pretty much worked out the same things that we already knew. Good job, you. Well done, scientists. Okay, I'm going to move over here slightly and change to the big gun because this seems like it's... Stop. There we go. This seems like it's a big gun kind of thing. I think we're pretty much done over there. Whoa, okay. Nope, you're going to keep kicking out babies, are you? It's going to keep kicking out babies. Do we need to shoot off these limbs? I think we need to shoot off the limbs. There we go. Yep, cool. The limbs are all off. Yeah, take that. I do love this whole kill the limbs thing. It's very clever. Whoa, okay. I wasn't expecting you right behind the door. I knew you'd be close, but not, not immediately behind the door. Oof, my goodness. <laughs> Floating limb. The physics in this game do leave... You know, they do leave things to be desired. But the graphics are beautiful. And the gameplay itself is lovely, apart from that guy having a party in the door. Sometimes you've just got to speed hump the door. You do you, my friend. You do you. Okay, I can't override you with a node because I haven't got one. And I may as well reload this gun now I've picked up some more ammunition. That noise you can hear in the background is that ragdoll enemy body just violently clipping through the door the entire time. I think I'm trying to find the organic sample, aren't I? Okay. Vegetative anomaly. You sound like the thing I need. Now, are there any... Are there any of those missile things that I can use? Because I... Ideally, that's what I want. Of course there's a hazardous anomaly detected. Oh, it's one of you guys. Let's go to three. And then run around the back. And shoot it in the back. Yep, stun you again with the special stun gun thing. Yeah. I like the fact that I can use my freeze time ability to slow that guy down. He gave me a power core, which is awesome because there was a door back there that needed a power core. But I'm thinking maybe I should save the power core. 
more important things like, you know, actually upgrading my suit. There's going to be one of you somewhere. There you are. Yep, you're down. Oh, boxes, please be full of ammunition because I absolutely need some ammunition. Thank you. How are you guys on YouTube doing anyway? You guys all good? Let me know what you're up to in the comments. I do try and respond if you want to have a chat. If not, just let me know if you're enjoying this Dead Space playthrough. I've never played the game, so this is all new to me. I don't know what to expect. I don't know what to do. This is all completely new. Genuinely, I'm not saying that just to make it a more interesting playthrough. I genuinely have never played this game before. What's in here? Oh. Ammunition, it seems. I knew there'd be something in there. I could see it bouncing around. And there's a vent on the wall. There's, there's actually quite a few vents on the wall. I don't like any room with vents in it. Because things grab you. And this makes me sad. Also, I can hear someone whispering constantly. That's not just me, is it? I can actually hear that. There's a vent on the wall just there again. It makes me nervous. Now, when I went over here, I'm positive I heard someone whispering something. There's a thing on the wall here. Oh, inventory full. Nice. Is there anything I can throw away? Nope. Should Probably keep it. Right, gotta go up, have we? Okay. Don't like all the noise I can hear. I'm on level one currently, so let's head to level two and see what happens. Let's use the big gun for a bit because I know it needs to charge before it fires. So this is level two, is it? Do I need to no, I need to go higher it seems. Seems I need to go higher than level 2. Ooh! Nice explosive barrels. They will come in handy in the future. Let's go up to level 3. Oh, for some reason my oxygen ticker has just started counting down already. You can be shot and killed straight away. And then reloaded. Maybe this gun is good when you get used to it. I don't know. This seems to be a shop that's just not activated. Okay. And now I bet it's going to send me down to level 2. Okay. I think I've cleared out most of these places now. Let's go down to level 2. I was wrong. We go down again. But before we go down again, I want to go in that room and see what there is. I also want to take one of these with me. Because if you have access to a missile, why would you not take it with you? Come on. To the refrigerator. Anything? Ah, it's a save station. Which means that I'm probably not meant to be going this way yet. Now, I am actually going to save while I'm here, but I know then that I've got to go back the other way. Let's save. I'm going to start using this bigger gun, just because I've got so much ammunition for this big gun. I kind of need to use all the ammunition for this gun up first. Ideally, I want to upgrade my suit again, but I haven't got the right things to do that with yet. Okay, the feeding system is online. Now where am I going? Um, anywhere? Um, 
this way again it seems more feeding systems initiate okay is that working or not working do I need to keep do I need to keep doing this oh ah right got you I see I've got to get down there okay um, every time it opens up I need to run around and shoot that guy okay so it needs to be open stasis field run around charge this gun and then shoot that guy but where from where I... did I get him brilliant got him 99% sure he's dead now he's dead now where do we go now we go up excellent so we're killing all these hosts hosts of things now all the hosts are dead uh, yeah we go this way cool don't like whatever that noise was oh, it's horrible you keep hearing noises but I've got no idea where they come from aha this was where we came before may as well save the game again because we've advanced a little bit more baby steps guys baby steps Come here, missile. Come and be my friend. My missile-based friend. Whoa! This whole thing is like a growth chamber. Gold semiconductor, but my inventory is full. Well, can I use anything in my inventory? Anything I don't need? Small med pack. You can be used up. Um, gold semiconductor. Come with me. Whoa! Okay. Oh, that was there because it was just trying to... Uh, No. I've got to hit this. No, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Whew. Oh my god, it pulls you closer every single time. I, I brought a missile with me for the specific purpose of defeating something difficult, and then something difficult happened, and my missile ran away. Silly little missile. Come here. Let's go. Let's let's adventure together, missile. I can show you the world. Shining. Shimmering. Splendid. I'm tempted to fire you down there. Yeah, take that, whatever you were. Here we go. Aha! A log. Sounds ominous. Makes the mining deck sound dangerous as well. You're on 50. You're on 6. Okay. I'm going to need more than 6 shots with this gun. And I'm definitely going to use the contact energy because I'm picking up loads of the ammo for this gun. Anything under here? Looks like another jumping puzzle. Is that piece of human going to come alive? Thought so. <laughs> Not alive anymore, sir. Where have I got to jump to? Okay, they're all spikes, so they're going to hurt me. That whole thing's going to hurt me because it's electrified. So, instead of jumping somewhere electrified, let's jump... Maybe somewhere where it's not electrified. So here? That's less electric. Excellent. Now are there any enemies anywhere? It's very hard to fight in 3D. Because I'm trying to work out where the hell I need to go. That's where I've just come from. So that's... What are you? Can I shoot you? Or can I stasis you? 
Yeah, there we go. The stasis obviously slows everything down. Now I need to work out where the hell I need to get to. So, over here. No, 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 no. Oh, I jumped into the electric. Grrr. All the deaths aren't even due to enemies. They're due to the environment. Okay. We can do this, guys. That was a different item to last time. That's interesting. And then we jump... Which way was it? We jump that way. There we go. We jump over here. But now where the heck do we need to get to? Do we need to get up there? I think we need to get up there. To get up there, we have to stop the electric thing, which is just there. Okay. Slowly getting this, so we need to go from there up there. Alright. So we slow you down with stasis, and then jump over there. Why can't I jump to you over there? Okay, cool. I've got to go up there and then across there, I see. So... Stasis over there, and then it was over there, up there, and then to there. Oh, come on! That was so close. I was basically on the right place. Ah, oh, okay. This is going to be another environment death thing, just like it was when we died on the outside because of that stupid, what was it, um, meteor shower kind of thing. Okay. Right, where are we going? Come on. We're going that way. So it was slow, jump, jump, jump. Made it! you. I've got a shot charged up for you and ready. It's charged and ready. Is that all there was? Okay. Fine. I'll just shoot you again. Okay. At least I haven't got to contend with the stupid electricity anymore. That's always good. I suppose the thing with this gun is you don't get much of a chance to take reactions. There's an enemy just there. So if I jump over here, I've got to turn around. Any more going to appear? Got you and got you! Oh, so she's hallucinating as well now. Great job. Good job, team. Good job with all hallucinating. We're doing well here. So I happen to know now that even the one person I was relying on to stay sane is having hallucinations as well. This beam being in 3D is just the most useful thing. So... What am I looking at and where am I going? So I'm going that way, am I? Okay. Right, so it's going to have to be stasis and jump. Oh no, apparently it's not stasis and jump. Not yet. It's jump over to that part. And then it'll be stasis and jump. Gotcha. God, 3D puzzles are a nightmare, man. They really are an absolute nightmare to try and do. OK, 
Okay, it was to there, to there, and then away, wasn't it? Away over to there, was it? I think this was it. This was as far away as we can get from the electric. And there was nothing over here that was electrified. And then it was back to there. Cool. Made it. Made it. Cool. Let's get out of this horrible zero G area. Ooh, a stasis recharger. That's kind of important. Brilliant. How much ammo do I have for this gun? Enough. I am ready to shoot anything I see in the face. And I am charging already. Because I have no doubt something is going to pop out. I don't need to be told that something's going to appear. You can't run while the gun's charging and it does this crazy screen shaking effect. So I'm kind of hoping an enemy does appear soon, otherwise I'm just going to be walking the entire way back. Like this. Okay, I'll just fire that way back. Can I change guns? Oh, no, that was just me wasting a shot. Okay, so lesson learned. Don't charge the gun up prematurely. Let's open whatever's in here. Hey, a power node! And save the game. Oh, always important to save the game, guys. Right, so our our security officer is going insane slowly because she's just seen her brother and shouldn't have been able to, so that's a problem. What's over here, just out of curiosity? Ooh, hello. Oh dear. Now are we going up or down? Um, resume. But F to go back. We're going down, it seems. So let's go down to level one. And let's get ready for things to spawn. Because I know this game's modus operandi by now. Aha, there we go. Give me things, please, from the wall. That'll do. What the heck? Come on! Oh, this gun is so inaccurate. Or oh, I'm just terrible with it. Okay, let's just go back to doing what I can do best. Right, maybe I should just use the gun that I'm good with and shoot off their limbs instead of trying to use the charge gun. Maybe the charge gun's good if they weren't running at me. Because I've got faith in this charge gun. I've got faith that it is a good gun. That just wasn't the right situation for this gun. Here we go. Also, I'm going to use a health kit because a small med pack and a small med pack gives me two spaces free in my inventory and brings me back up to full health. Two things I'm happy with. Okay. Right, let's get back to the happy, happy fun times. All the any of you guys going to get up? I'm sure some of you probably are. If not, guess what? It's a stampin' party. One of these... Ah, this door was locked because it needed a node. I'm going to use a node and see what happens. Right. What are you going to give me? Ammo, 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 med pack, pulse rounds, a thing I can't open, and money. That was... Okay, that was fair. I'll take that. I'm going to be honest, I kind of needed all that. This is good. Pulse rounds especially because I can recharge my favourite little gun. I like this gun. I know it's the gun that you start off with, but I like it. Not 
not listening to you. You are not real, and I am definitely hallucinating. It seems everything's pretty much happy again. I can hear something. But I'm not sure what it is. Let's go to this. What can I hear? Oh, it was a can that fell over. Whew, that was close. Okay, let's buy some stuff. I've got one of those semiconductors to sell before the huge tentacle grabbed me. Contact energy. Sell the gold semiconductor. Anything else I can sell? Apparently not. I've got everything else. Ammo for the plasma cutter. I've got 33,000 credits. To be fair, I could buy some power nodes. I'm going to buy some power nodes. And then loads of plasma energy. And then another power node, actually. Because when I get to a bench, I want to be able to upgrade my suit quite a lot. And then we'll save the game. Power nodes seem to be important because ammo is nice for the time being but power nodes are a constant upgrade and I think that's a better long-term investment okay hey we've got the oxygen back brilliant and with the food storage lockdown lifted I should be able to go into food storage and see what this massive thing is that crashed into the ship. Isn't this the organic mass that weighed 100 kilotons? Whoa. Okay. Wow. This is like being inside a vein. What is that? Like a blood clot or something. I'm going to have the machine gun out just in case any of those little skittering face hugger star creatures appear. And I don't like the fact this has just given me some ammunition. That's obviously a sign there's about to be a fight. Whoa, okay. And, huh, a medium med pack. Food filter. Yep, this is the poison that should kill it. Yeah, there we go. Biological warfare. Okay, I mean, I'm not sure what it is, but I'll give it my best go. Just so you know, YouTube... Oh my god, that's disgusting. Just so you know, YouTube, I might die. Um, what happens if I fire these things into those things? They look... What is that? Okay, well, I'm going to grab you. If I walk forward, are you going to... Yeah, there we go. Yep, you're down. Any more explosive barrels? There's one. Come on, pop out. You know you want to. Oh, okay. More of you. Ah, no! Yep, you're down as well. Come on, pop out, dude. Got to shoot you quickly. Yeah, there we go, before you get anywhere else. Maybe I'll use this big, powerful explosive gun. Yep.
There we go, I just shot you several times in the mouth. That's what the big explosive gun is for. For killing the huge space anus. That's what it's for. Sorry, but that's exactly what it looks like. Don't you die on me, Hammond. He's gone again. No sign of his rig anywhere. It's up to us now. I've got a plan to get off this ship. I've located an SOS beacon on the mining deck. If you can get down there and activate it, we might be able to send a distress call. Nope, no, that's a body. I don't know how much longer the turtle holds. But while you're doing that, I'm going to pick up all the items that are in this room. Because I'm going to be honest, I want all of them. There we go. Oh, no, storage full. Okie dokie. Right. I've got what I think is all of the items. May as well use everything while I'm here. The zero gravity bit continues to impress me, the fact that you can just run around. Do I have any small med packs? Yes, I do. I can use a small med pack and pick up a medium med pack. Is there any any reason you'd ever go close to this thing? God, that is truly disgusting. No, I can't grab anything from it. Okay, All right, I think we are done. Let us return. But hey, we killed the giant thing. First time as well. First time. The poison probably weakened it quite a bit, let's be fair. I thought something was going to happen in that uh, in that tunnel, but nothing did. Okay, let's save. Good job, YouTube. Thank you for your moral support. We got there. Okay guys, end this video here. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for joining me so far on my Dead Space adventure. We continue in the next video. Until then, have a good day. I'll see you soon.